What's up, everybody? This is Tuba Solo coming at you. Hi, my name is Steve, and this channel is all about hiking, backpacking, and enjoying the outdoors in Southern California and beyond. If that interests you, consider subscribing. I want to talk to you guys about an interesting uh, kind of a phenomenon that I've seen coming up here in the last few weeks in the uh, backpacking community. Um, it all kind of started with the uh, Second Chance Hiker. Um, it's essentially a, uh, a bigger fellow, which I could definitely relate to. Uh, he's hiking the PCT, and um, it kind of really shed some light on some interesting uh, aspects of backpacking that, um, I don't know, I don't really hear too many people talking about it. But um, yeah, essentially it's fitness. After watching the uh, Second Chance Hiker uh, for a while the other week, um, Follow Bigfoot, he had a very interesting video on uh, him going on a keto diet. And um, I myself too have, you know, kind of considered what I could do better as far as fitness is concerned. And even this, um, one of these last few magazines I got here from Backpacker Magazine, it was talking about getting trail ready. And I just kind of wanted to throw it out there. I mean, um, I was kind of wondering, what do you guys do for getting ready for the trail? I know um, there's some things that I do. For a while there, I was um, not able to do some stuff. And I'll, that'll come up in a video a uh, little bit later explaining kind of what happened over the last couple of years. <laughs> After Mount Whitney, there's a, there's a, some pretty interesting stuff that had happened to me that I've actually never brought up to anyone, um, at least not on YouTube. You know, my closest backpacking friends know, but um, but that's in a forthcoming video. But uh, it just kind of made me think, you know, what exactly is it that um, you guys do for fitness? What is it that you guys actually do um, when it comes to preparing for the for the trail? I know some of you can actually go during the winter, but I know for me at least, there's there's definitely a lull during winter as far as like my hiking and backpacking and and I feel like every single season I've kind of got to ramp up to get ready for the season and um you know I'm just kind of wondering what is it that you guys do to get ready um you know what I've started to incorporate this year which I used to do kind of back in the beginning when I was first hiking and backpacking um I went ahead and started to incorporate weightlifting again into my routine um I have a full um uh, CrossFit gym in my garage. Now, I definitely don't have a CrossFit body. Uh, seems like ever since Brianna was born, I've just kind of let myself go. You know, it's a lot easier to not do stuff than to, to be pretty diligent. But uh, right before Brianna was born, I was probably in, uh, in about the best shape I'd been in many years. But um, yeah, I was just wondering, what is it that you guys do as far as working out? Do you guys do weightlifting? Do you guys walk uh, just around your block. Do you guys ever carry your backpack? One other thing that I do often, I, I kind of allude to it from time to time that I go, um, I go hiking at night in the hills and, uh, at the Fullerton loop. And, um, there's been times I've actually worn my backpack in preparation for the season. Yeah. You look like an idiot walking around and people kind of stare at you kind of weird, but, uh, but yeah, I mean, that's one of the things too that I've done over the years to kind of uh, prepare for the season. Yeah, that's pretty much it. Again, just kind of noticed some things happening and, and lining up where it kind of made me think like, you know, hey, what, what exactly do other people do about fitness? But that's it for tonight. Hope you guys have a wonderful evening. I look forward to your comments. And uh, yeah, we'll talk next time. <laughs>